This is a review of an Eakins uh, microscope that I recently purchased on AliExpress for about $90, including shifting. That's an amazing price. And uh, with the low cost, with the free shipping, it does take some time because it is coming from China. It's a Chinese brand called Eakins. Uh, the nice feature that the reason why I bought this is it has HDMI and VGA because you may have some VGA monitors kicking around, so you don't have to pay any money for the monitor. It has a, a one quarter inch sensor inside, and um, everything came quite um, nicely and a little well packed in the box with bubble wrap. And the lens uh, magnification is 130 times. It also has an LED light here. The only thing with this LED light, it does make a slight hum when you turn it on all the way. But if you're not worried about noise, that's okay. And also the remote controller comes without a battery, but you can find a battery from a used laptop. The image quality is quite good. You can see the quality there. On uh, the left-hand side there, this is the image quality. I just put this on a document reader. The reason I'm, why I'm using the document reader, it has a nice tray that can slide back and forth and also has a locking mechanism for where the electronics um, is. So you can easily slide it around. That's a really nice option. I just put it on the front there and I have it in a, in a fixed position so I don't have to worry too much about focusing. And I use the document reader on my laptop there. You can see that I can uh, zoom in. Now this is comparing with a razor blade. You can see the image quality is quite well uh, good. There's a couple, um, uh, you can see a little bit of uh, black lines in the dark but it seems to be quite good. We're just zooming in and you can see on compared to the left and right on the right on my laptop I'm just using a document reader and you can see it's not as clear as on using this scope here on the left here. Uh, the only thing is you have to manually focus whereas my document uh, reader you don't have to manually focus it automatically focuses but if you have it a fixed position that's okay. With the remote control you can also zoom in and when you go into about four times digitally um, it will freeze the frame. That's a very useful option. And the other great feature is the rotation because sometimes you need to read the things on IC chips and rotation it can be useful if you're looking at it upside down. Uh, so the overall rating for this scope, I'd give the price 10 out of 10, the video quality 9 out of 10 because when it's not lighted up very well, you can see some digital interference. The feature is 7 out of 10 because you can't really turn this off without unplugging it. The video quality is quite good and um, if you already have your own stand it's a very cheap option for using this as a scope. I hope you enjoyed this uh, review. You can also look at other reviews and my other repair videos at nuisanceelectronics.ca.